Hi, this is William here, and today we're going to talk about three tactics all affiliate marketers need to succeed. So there are three major tactics that I worked before with online marketing and is continuing to work in the online affiliate marketing world of today. With these top three marketing tips, you'll be able to increase your sales in online affiliate marketing. So what are these three tactics? One, use unique web pages <coughs> to promote each separate product you're marketing. Do not lump all of it together just to save some money on web hosting. It's best to have a site focusing on each and every product and nothing more. Always include product reviews on the website so visitors will have an initial understanding of what the product can do to those who buy them. Also include testimonials from users who have already tried the product. Be sure that these customers are more than willing to allow you to use their names and photos on the site of the specified product you are marketing. You can also write articles highlighting the uses of the product and include them on the website as an additional page. Make the pages attractive, compelling, and include calls to act on the information. Each headline should attract the readers to try and read more, even contact you. Highlight your special points. This will help your readers learn what the page is about and want to find out more. 2. Offer free reports to your readers. If possible, position them at the very top side of your page so they simply cannot be missed. <clears throat> Try to create autoresponder messages that will be mailed to those who input their personal information into your sign-up box. According to research, a sales close usually on the seventh contact with a prospect. Only two things can happen with the web page alone, close sale or the prospect leaving the page to never return again. By placing useful information in, the, in their inboxes at certain specified periods, you remind them of the product they thought they want later and will find out from that the sale is closed. Be sure that the content is directed towards specific reasons to buy the product. Do not make it sound like a sales pitch. Also, focus on important points like how your product can make life and things easier and more enjoyable. Include compelling subject lines in the email. As much as possible, avoid using the word free because they are still older spam filters that dumps those kinds of contents into the junk before even reading them first. Convince those who signed up for your free reports they will be missing something big if they do not avail of your products and services. 3. Get the kind of traffic that is targeted to your product. Just think, if the person who visited your website has no interest whatsoever in what you are offering, they will be among those who move on and never come back. So write articles for publication in e-zines and e-reports. This way you can include locate publications that are focusing on your target customers and what you have put up might just grab their interest. Try to write a minimum of two articles per week with at least three to six hundred words in length. By continuously writing and maintaining these articles, you can generate as many as 100 targeted readers to your site in a day. In summary, always remember that only one out of 100 people are likely to buy your product or get your services. So, if you can generate as much as a thousand targeted hits for your website in a day, that means you can make ten sales based on the average statistic. And that concludes the presentation on three tactics all affiliate marketers need to succeed. And this is William, and we'll see you the next time.